How you doing? Eric here from Shepard Motorsports. Today we're going to take a look at the new Influx Jacket from Scorpion. If you're looking for a warm weather, ventilated mesh, sports style jacket that delivers a lot of style and protection, then the Influx should be right up your alley. New to the Scorpion lineup, the Influx replaces the company's highly popular Eddy Jacket as their core product for warm weather riding. Now looking at the chassis, you have two types of mesh. Throughout most of the core, you have your traditional mesh. However, in the pecs, you have a 3D spacer mesh. Now what this 3D design does is it lifts the material off your skin and works horizontally to promote airflow to the air you need it most, your upper core. Beyond the mesh, you have 600D panels in the high abrasion zones of the shoulders and elbows. And for impact protection, you have SAS Tech CE certified SC1 and 2 armor in the shoulders and elbows. There is also a PE foam back pad. However, the back pad can be upgraded to a SAS Tech 10 millimeter back protector if you choose. The nice thing is, all the armor can be removed if you're one of those people that don't like to ride with armor. Scorpion improved upon the Eddy jacket with this Influx jacket in several ways. They improved the overall look and style with more raised areas in the shoulders and triceps, and then you have the raised area in the abdomen as well. This gives a nice design aesthetic to the jacket, and for guys like me that don't have an Adonis body, it kind of gives us a little bit of definition. They also improved upon nighttime riding with increased reflectivity. You have three quarter inch stripes of night vis material, going across the collarbone, just above the elbow, and along the backs of the shoulders so that when those headlights hit, you illuminate like a shooting star. A really nice feature about the Influx jacket is that it has a micro fleece lined rollover collar. So if you have a beard, scruff, or just sensitive skin around the neck or chin area, that micro fleece will keep that area from getting irritated. Now you can fine tune the jacket to suit your body style or riding type with adjustable tabs at the inner bicep, there's adjustable waist tabs, and then at the cuffs, you have zippers, which will allow for more airflow or improved comfort. Another important feature that we find on the Influx jacket that wasn't on the Eddy jacket is accordion stretch panels. Now these panels allow for ease of movement in key areas such as the shoulders and elbows. If you find yourself riding in cooler temperatures, you can always zip in the included air guard liner. Now this liner is full sleeve, 100% windproof, and with it in place, you can ride in temperatures down to about 60 degrees and still feel really comfortable. Again, going back to the durability of this Influx jacket, you have a heavy-duty YKK main zipper with a molded TPR pull. Makes it easy to manipulate with your gloves on. There's a Velcro tab at the top to keep the pull from flopping around and hitting you in the face. For storage, you have two exterior zippered hand warmer pockets. Then moving to the inside, there's a Napoleon pocket on the left-hand side that zips into the shell. Behind the uh, air guard liner, you have a perforated lining that's going to promote maximum airflow. Incorporated into the lining are two large cargo pockets. Then on the right hand side, above the cargo pocket, is a zippered media storage pocket with cord management system. Now the nice thing about the air guard liner is that it has a pass through that allows you to access the media pocket, which is a very nice touch. The Influx is available in sizes small to 3XL. You can get it in black, gray, red, or high vis. Now we already did a video on Scorpion's entry level mesh sport style jacket, the Drafter 2. This jacket falls into that same warm weather category, however it delivers more features, benefits, and styling at a slightly higher price point. To learn more about this jacket or any of the jackets we carry at Chaparral Motorsports, visit shapmoto.com, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and as always, thank you for watching.